Hello guys and welcome to the second part of my uh, champion list series. This video is gonna be about Ari. Ari is a burst assassin battle mage. Her main damage type is magic damage, so she wants to stack ability power. In the Aatrox video I forgot to mention uh, this uh, feature of the list. Uh, sometimes she can also be played in support and um, when do you pick her and why do you pick her? Well, with her Q she can push out waves really fast even though the minion wave uh, spawn rates or like movement speed rates, not spawn rates, speed rates were changed. Um, she can't roam as well anymore, but post 6 she can join skirmishes and fights all over the map really fast with her ult. She can like dash onto people, she can get onto backline really easily if you position well with her. And she can get, generate picks really well and once she gets rolling she's really hard to stop in a game because she can be all over the place. And uh, that's why she can also be slotted into support maybe. I don't know if she can be slotted top lane. I don't know if she can be slotted AD carry, but I mentioned her in mid and support mainly because that's where people play her. And um, yeah, she's a really solid laner. Um, she can be locked down though, because she's like a mid rangey dive in champ. And I would also describe her as like mainly snowball and red, but also really strong scaling wise. So she's like. She could be 50-50, I slotted her 60-40 because I have seen some really, really upfront Ari players that snowball games completely out of control once they get rolling. From behind the champion can also be useful, that's why it's not like mainly only red, like she's also some sort of controlly. But um, in that regard she's like your staple mage in mid lane together with like champions like Oriana and some other mages that have been around for years and uh, yeah she's like good at uh, playing forward and when it comes to countering her I mean her ult also is also coded like um, like a dash right so it's like what's good against her well maybe also Anivia I don't know maybe Poppy again because she's uh, also some sort of mid rangey champ Talia is also really good against her probably Lissandra is probably also really good because Lissandra's theme is like coin and click seeing. And yeah, basically just champions that can like silence her when she goes in, like maybe Cho'Gath. Um, I don't know if Malphite is... I mean Malphite could be good. Like <laughs> Ramos maybe. Just things that lock her down so she cannot dash in, dash out, get her reset because that's what she wants to do, right? She wants to play forward, she wants to get resets, she wants to clean up fights. That's what she wants to do as a champion. Uh, regarding runes and items, as I said, you can like theory craft runes yourself. It depends. It really depends on mid lane matchup. Just watch really really good Ari players play on the Korean server, for example. Just go into pro builds. Just watch your builds. It really depends on game. Um, Ari in general just really really strong in snowballing. Really really strong in solo queue. Therefore, because the games are really chaotic, she, she thrives in chaotic fights. Uh, but if enemy team is coordinated and enemy team picks these sort of champions, she can have a hard time. But in, in general, she's a really, really solid champion. If you want to practice on mid lane, you can try to pick her up. I would highly recommend for beginners as well, because she's not that hard to master or to pick up. Um, yeah, that's it about Ari in this list. Uh, you can slot her here, obviously, mid rangey. Um, some dive uh, neutralizing control matches are good against her. Poke can also be okay with her, but um, you have to consider that she can just dive onto them level 6 if you only have one CC spell. You have to hit it, otherwise, you could be dead because she's a bit 
Dive heavy and assassin heavy, so poke mages might struggle a bit into her later on. Not early landing wise, but yeah. So you mainly just want to play like control mages and tanks with point clicks you see against her, so you can like try to lock her down with team compositions. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching this video. Next video will be about Akali. I hope you enjoyed. Um, don't forget to like the video if you're interested in this type of content again. I highly appreciate you watching. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.